mushroom tank. The better, the fighting fish, is choking on a shrimp. I'm gonna try and get him out and see if I can get the shrimp out. I've never seen this before. Okay, he's not choking anymore. It's hard to see. There's <laughs> so much duckweed in this tank to get the water out clear. There's the half of the shrimp. I think that's the yellow cherry shrimp. The one that <laughs> I haven't been able to see for a little while. Maybe I found out why. I've been hiding from this guy. He seems alright now. He wasn't moving before as you saw. Um, once I kind of caught him and pushed him over here, he spat that out. So maybe it just kind of shocked him into getting rid of the shrimp. What do we do now? Because this is the shrimp tank. It's not the better tank with some shrimp in it. It's not the endless tank with some shrimp in it. The shrimp are the priority. So, uh... You're gonna go live with the Tetris for now. I can't put him back in there. In his new home. There's only one shrimp in here. Hopefully <laughs> you can't find him and there's enough places to hide. He's in here with uh, seven neons, two rummy nose, and a pleco. Uh, probably not a shock. To, uh, to do something pretty quickly and uh, He'll be fine for this tank. This tank's going to change in the next couple of weeks because a lot of these fish are going in the, uh, the large tank. Uh, and we'll figure out what to do with him then. But uh, maybe maybe he's going to be the boss of this new tank once it's all uh, rescaped. There's a whole bunch of plans. I've got, actually got a few things all ready to go to redo this tank uh, and make it a little bit more no fuss. Uh, I wasn't sure what I was going to put in. I was thinking, do I just put the shrimp in there or do I just put the endless? <laughs> that is quite hard to Might be dictating <laughs> what we do with the, uh, the blue ledge.